So I thought I'd show you what my current transportation is looking like. This is for whoever's uh, going to be processing my loan. Um, what I've got on here is uh, Sun X3 AX with an electric motor on it. The motor's actually in the front and it's controlled by a controller um, which is underneath the seat. And then there's a throttle up on the handlebars. Um, it's a 500 watt motor and uh, I've got uh, two 12 amp hour batteries in the back here which gives me probably about maybe 15 to 20 mile range on it and I've gone on some good long rides with this uh, trike um, in the back of it as you can see there's not a whole lot of room where I can carry things like my groceries, my instruments to church, um, and my stuff I need for work, my e-sight glasses as well as my lunchbox, and extra rain gear if I needed it, and it sort of become more of a pain to have to carry all that. Um, I did write it for probably almost three to four years now and it's been good for getting me to point A to point B and but there's some other things to it that aren't good like with the cargo and uh, some other things I had to do to it to make it uh, like I wanted it now um, the, uh, lights here on the side, those I actually had to hire somebody to put on. Those weren't, uh, put on them, um, by the bike shop. The seat there, um, actually has been wearing down on me. Um, I'm 230 pounds, and the maximum load on this bike is about 250, and with the weight of the batteries, it's kind of wearing down on it. Um, where the new trike I'm looking at has a maximum payload of, I think they said like 550 pounds on it. So, and that includes the battery weight as well, so if you take the 550 minus battery weight, I think it's like it could support like I don't know, 450, something like that. I'll have to look that up and get that information to you. Um, but I know I can support a lot. Um, as for cargo goes, this is what I'm having to use now for my to carry my cargo. And if I you need to take my instruments to church in. I would have to strap my bass guitar down on the trailer and put my pedal board inside the box there and, you know, drive careful so it doesn't uh, get banged around on the inside and all that and w without having to ask somebody for a ride. And, I mean, which I have been getting rides to church whenever I play on Sundays. Um, there's other maintenance issues I'm going through with it. And I'll show you some of the wiring down here. Get the focus. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, there's some of the wiring. That's a mess. And that. And... With something that's pre-manufactured to keep me out of the rain, keep my instruments protected, able to get me groceries, and get me 
even more from point A to point B, not only from point A to point B, but to point C and D as well. You know, would be a huge help for me to get out and do things. And as I was saying earlier, this strike's been good. And I've put a lot of money into it. Probably almost half of what the new vehicle is going to be worth. And, uh, but, I mean, if you can see those wires right there and that. And again, this is something that I've taken, you know, three or four years to complete. You know, because you know, of the funding and all that. And with the funding, it's going to change um, at the end of this year. It's going to go up nearly double what I'm getting now. So, I mean, there's no doubt I'm going to be able to pay the loan. And there's the trailer again. And as you can see, there's not very much space there at all in that trailer. Um, and down here's the battery packs. I've had to run three separate batteries on this. I've got the two 12 amp hour batteries and I've got a small little um, 5 amp hour 12 volt battery running all the lights on it. Um, this light right here on the tail or on the rear end that is uh, Hit the focus there. That is actually run by the uh, batteries off the uh, track, off the uh, 12 amp hour 36 volt batteries, the two I've got in there. The rest of the lights and the horn there run off the 12 volt system, which I've got two separate boxes underneath the seat for them. And Let's see if I can get in to show you. I don't know if you can see that. There's one. And there's the other. So. I would really appreciate your guys' help in making my life better. And I know that this is something I'm going to be able to do. And uh, thanks again for uh, considering my application.